ver qué pasa aquí. forgotten what it is to be strong you know our heroes used to be gods and now our heroes are godless weak feeble diseased we let the weak dictate to the powerful and then we are shocked to find ourselves adrift History knows the value of sacrifice, of culling the herd so that it stays strong. Over and over, the lives of the many have outweighed the lives of the few. This is how we survived, and we forgot her. And now, the bill has come due. Now, the collapse is upon us. And this time, the lives of the few outweigh the lives of the many. And when a nation that's never known hunger or desperation descends into madness, we'll be ready. We will call the herd. We will do what needs to be done. Watch your time. <laughs> Sir. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. Give me a hand, kid. <coughs> Eli, is this? Yep. What the fuck is the deputy doing here? Jacob took a shine to him, same as us. You're gonna be okay, hero. Whitetail's got you now. <coughs> We're bringing him back to the wolf's den? Where else? Tammy's not gonna like this. Don't worry about Tammy, she'll be fine. <coughs> Now hold on, Weedy and I agree. Oh, you agree? Whoa, whoa, whoa! I was a best and impartial observer. 
This is stupid. And this is dangerous. You both know better. What was I supposed to do? Leave him to die. Tammy. They've been in that room for God knows how long. I've seen what it does to people. You haven't. You can't trust this one. That's what everyone said about you. But luckily, I didn't listen. This is not up for discussion. We need him. That's all there is to it. Understand? You're right. She took that real well. Out! He didn't do anything. I meant what I said. We need you. Let's get you some rest. Hey, bud. down the hall. E Eli's been waiting for you there. Gotta watch out for a while. Look who's back from the dead. Love to talk, but Eli needs a word with you. Eli says these Peggy's deserve everything coming their way. Hell fucking yes. Cowboy up real quick. Make sure you're armed. Don't want to leave no one to those pigs. See you standing. I'm trying to track you down, deputy. Dutch speaks highly. Look, I'll get right to it. I know a good soldier when I see one. We're bleeding bodies up here. No two ways about it. I don't know if we'll be able to hold out more than a week at this rate. Times are desperate, to say the least. I'm trying to get some footholds back, so I sent a handful of whitetails out to sabotage the visitor center. The cult's been using it as a depot for that bliss shit. But our guys walked right into a fucking trap. 
They've been taken hostage and we're up against the clock. If I just send another group in there, we risk losing everything. But you, you're something that cult ain't expecting. You're the only one I got around here who can handle this, Step. Only one I trust to handle this. I'm counting on you. You'll need to go in quiet. Cult gets windier around, they're liable to kill our people. There's a bow on the table if you need it. Get our people back, Depp. Good luck. Your guns are back. I'll look after. Must have overlaid on the circuit. Do not blow up in my balls. So you've met Eli. You're in good hands now. He'll get you squared away with anything they need up there in the mountains. I'll still keep an eye on you, though. Talk soon, kid. Don't worry about him. So beautiful, isn't she? We were pregnant with our first child. And we were just babies ourselves, really. And I was terrified. I'm becoming a father, mostly about money. She wasn't worried. She had faith that things were going to work out. She always had faith. And one day she was going to go visit a friend. Hmm. It was an accident. The Lord take it. They rushed me to a hospital and put me in a room with this little pink bundle stuffed with tubes. And they said that I had to be strong because my little girl was going to live. God was looking out for our daughter. And they left me alone in the room with her. I just stared. my daughter, so helpless, so innocent, when all she had in the world was me, when nobody from nowhere was me. And in that moment, I knew that God was testing me. He was laying out a path before me, and all I had to do was choose. So I put my hand on my little girl's head. And I leaned in and I could smell it. And we prayed together. Prayed for wisdom. Prayed for strength. And I knew. I heard God's plan for me. I took my fingers and I put them on that little plastic tube that was taped to her angelic face and I pinched it shut. And after a little while, her legs began to kick in and kick. And then nothing. Stillness. Release. The Lord giveth and the Lord. Sacrifice. These are all part of his test. And we have to prove that we can serve God, no matter what he asks. We've done well.
good. Call the herd. Keep moving. Watch your time. 